Yo, what's going on, my amigos and amigas? Hope everyone's having a fantastic day. I almost messed the intro up. <laughs> I almost stutter like the idiot that I am. I hope everyone's doing well. If you saw yesterday's video, the topic was kind of serious. You know, I made some jokes, some jabs, but it was kind of a quote unquote serious video. I'm not really used to those. I like to clown on people. That's what I like to do for fun because I'm, I'm that pathetic, honestly. I said we just get right into it. This is a new video that I found. It's fresh out of the oven. And this is someone who has a friend who's in the hospital and this girl decide to take out her phone take off her mask and record herself crying for tiktok clout um what in the actual fuck <laughs> just what? so this girl's friend is you know dying out here tubes everywhere tubes up the asshole and she thinks you know what i'm bored i'm sick of watching this person slowly dying you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna just take out my phone take off my mask so people can see my sadness this is the definition of cloud chasing cloud chasing has officially went too far i mean you can't even die in peace anymore if you get into a car accident if you get hurt if something breaks and you go into a coma or, or you're just unconscious for a few hours, you can't even rest in peace without someone pulling TikTok and trying to get clout like, oh my God, can we please get 25,000 likes and comments in order to save my friend who's dying? Let me just feel my dying friend. What can I do? Be respectful. Stay there, be quiet and wait for her to wake up, hopefully. Or let me just uh, take out my phone, record her and cry in front of people for clout. And I know people are going to say sensitive. Well, she just showing her emotions she's being true if i was in the hospital and i was there because one of my friends you know is close to dying or got hit by a drunk driver or whatever the last thing on my mind will be to pull out my phone and start live streaming on youtube yo guys what's going on thank you so much for tuning in to the live stream of my friend dying if anyone wants to donate 50 dollars to the live stream uh that would be a really appreciated like that would not be on my mind let alone get on tiktok and make this fucking cringy video absolutely not there's no way you can justify this she just showed her emotions no no she's not she's doing this for clout clout chasing at its finest if you ask me honestly we've gone to the point where we can't even die peacefully without someone being exploited for easy views sympathy views oh my god your friend died i'm so sorry here let me drop a follow let me drop a heart let me drop a comment Hopefully this brings him back. You know what I'm saying? Haha, <laughs> yeah. Pathetic. You're a piece of shit, honestly. No reason to do this. Extremely out of pocket. I was gonna end it there, but I realized the video was way too short. So let's just take a look at one other video that I found. And I'm not even going to lie. When I saw this video, chills went down my spine. Not because it was amazing, epic, very, very cool. No, 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 none of that. Because of how cringe it was. I mean, let's just check this out. Teaching my little sister, you never need a man. Both of you belong to the streets. <laughs> oh my god, not these fucking people. Mm -mm -mm. I don't need no man. Like, shut the fuck up, honestly. No one cares. No one asked. Now, please shut the fuck up, honestly. Now, I'm all for loving yourself and for saying, no, I don't need women. I don't need men. I'm extremely independent. And I 100% rock with that, okay? I'm with that shit, okay? But when it comes to the point where you're like, all men are toxic, men suck, men can go choke on, I don't know, fucking sausage and die. When it gets to that point, it's like, okay, who hurt you? And how's your relationship with your father? Do you even have a dad? I know people who never had dads who walked out or whatever, and all of them are cool. There's only a small, a small percentage of people who hate men for absolutely no reason. And, you know, there's men who hate women as well for no reason. And it's pretty gay, if you ask me. It's pretty cringe. I'm equal here. I hate both women and men equally because that's how I am. That's how I roll. This ain't it, Chief. And if you're teaching your sister, well, fucking Cardi B songs or whatever the fuck this cringe song was, and then saying stuff like that, it's kind of cringe, bro. And yes, I get it. Teaching your sister or your brother to be independent is epic and i support that this is kind of a good message being delivered by the wrong person i don't know if that makes any sense this is as cringe as the people who hate on women for no reason Venom. aren't you like 30 why is she acting like a 15 year old here <laughs> venom the fucking eminem song that song is a banger okay i don't care what anyone says eminem's venom that's fucking fire but anyways guys you know two videos enough to make me want to kill myself but i'm not going to do that because well i like money so i need to collect the back but anyways guys hope everyone's having a fantastic day i hope you guys enjoy the video i mean this video was pretty bad but especially the woman using her dying friend for views 
But anyways, guys, love you. Thank you so much for the support. I want to give a big thanks to my channel members. You guys are the best. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for supporting the channel. You guys are the goats. And if you can and if you want, you can become a channel member starting at $1. You get some awesome, epic, very cool emojis. So anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. You guys rock. And I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. If I'm not dead from the cringe. <laughs> All right, have a great one. Peace.